Shoo! Well, ladies and gentlemen. Is that her right there? I don't know what we're buying. That's a, that's actually pretty good size. We can ask them about that. Well, anyways, I'm at a dealer right now. This is the Wise Equipment Dealer. Uh, they sell Volvo equipment. So we're looking for an excavator. Banjo said we need to dig more ponds. Bigger. Bigger. Deeper. Uh, deep, bigger and deeper. That's what Banjo's here for. These are cool too. I don't, these are the things that you, I think you wouldn't put many hours on. So owning, like you just, once it's packed, it's, yeah, yeah. You know, I'll see you next well, week. Well, for you know like I mean? farm fields. Like, oh. if you're going to put water on like a farm field and it's oh. tilled over here, then you got to pack it back down before you flood it. We could do that for the duck marsh. Mm. Those... Oh, we could just rent one. Yeah, probably. I, I, well, maybe I'll have to ask them, them. ask them how much yeah. it is. But, anyways, we're here to look at excavators. Well, we're one of these big boys. The front loaders? Yeah. I always look at those going, what would I do with that? But yeah, it, looks, it, is, like, it looks cool. I mean, you would move. You would move some dirt with those yeah. bad boys. So they've got excavators, they got front loaders, they got articulate. By the way, you know how expensive articulating trucks are? Like, like them suckers. Well, that's an older one, dude. They are so expensive. Like way more expensive. Yeah, they're like that. Like half a million dollars for a truck. That's for a truck. That's for a car. For a truck? And to rent them, it's like 12 G's a month. And I'm like, excuse me. So I, I mean, I don't really need one. Chad's got like four, so we're good there. But one thing, I want to get more involved. All right, we're we're making ponds. Meow. You think that must this must be a farm cat? I guess we're not. Kitty. You got the bobcat? I don't know, dude. Just, my senses are always tingling. You never wow. know. So I, I want to get more involved, right? I want, I want to get more, in, in, whether we're doing ponds at the ranch, we're doing clearing at the ranch, we're doing stuff at my house, we're doing stuff at the new house. <sighs> so I'm not I'm not 100% sure. Look what we're dealing with, folks. These are not small. So I have ran. I'll have to look. I'm pretty sure the one I ran when I crushed the Flare B&B. <laughs> and the cop car. And we took out the beaver dam. Dude, oh God, that's a good one there. Oh God, oh God, we might be gone. We might die. Oh God. Was a 300. That was a big mamma jam. We got some stuff done. So I don't know if they've got any of them. This is a 350, which I don't think anything bigger than a 300. It's good audio. Yeah. I don't think anything bigger than a 300 is necessary, but something like, it's gotta be big, bigger enough. That's not English. More bigger, nope, that isn't either. Bigger than my mini. And it's big and it's enough bigger. Why the hell is English tough? It's big enough. It's big enough than my mini though. What am I trying to say here? My mini. It's it's bigger. A than lot bigger than the mini. Correct. So it has, it has to be a big enough difference between yes. the two. Like I don't want to just step up a little. I want to yeah. step up a lot, but I also don't want like you know to spend a million dollars. Small so. projects you can use your mini. Correct. And yes. You that's want it to be like a big split. Difference. Split. So yeah. you don't. Otherwise, you get one machine that's like good for everything, but like not really good for little jobs and not really good for big jobs. Well, I've already got the mini, which is good for little jobs. So I want something that's like a good all around for big jobs. It doesn't have to be massive jobs, but in the middle of the road. So we'll talk to. Uh, am I in the way? Okay. You're gonna. What if these backs are my truck? That'd be the best thing to happen yeah, to that sucker. Not mine though. No, not not yours. So I think the the sales guy, he's gonna come out here in a second. But we wanted to see kind of I don't know heavy I mean I know how to run heavy equipment, don't get me wrong. I've ran it a decent amount, but like I don't know enough. Like this is a this is an eighty eight. This is my size. You like that? It, that's like For a me. that's like <laughs> a thirty five. Yeah. So this it's, isn't big it's enough. A, no, that's why that's what I'm thinking. It's a step up, but it's like not quite enough. Most of the things this can do, your you mini could, can the do. mini could do as well. And it, the re you got to think about the reach for digging ponds. We I think we got to get at least maybe I should ask them that. What gets me probably 20, 20 feet if we're yeah. gonna dig ponds? This is a nice location for filming. I, I enjoy this a lot. So maybe I could ask them that. But dude, doesn't like am I the only one that just gets absolutely aroused when I'm around equipment? Like it's so cool. Like I don't because it's just like it's everything here is like so cool, so powerful. Like. You can do anything you want, really. Like this is like my TikTok. Really? This is what you this is what, this is what you see on yeah. your construction talk. Okay, so I did I did some research. So this is called a a, a no tail. Okay. So you see, it doesn't have an ass. It ain't it ain't thick. So it, it can be like 360. So your or? so when you swing your your butt doesn't hit like a tree branch. Okay. So like basically it's just as far forward as back. So it spins within kind of the tracks. Okay. So you don't have like a real long tail. So, so really no tail. front or back. I mean. So yeah, if you your tracks aren't it, hitting it, then, then you're good. Gonna hit yeah. it when you're going huh. like that. So I looked that up, which is good for real tight areas, yeah. which is nice. I'm also looking at this. That's a freaking camera. Okay, yeah. so you got that going for you. I don't know. If, I don't know if all these suckers oh, wow. have that or not. Like a 360. They might have a 360 camera. That's got sick. So I mean, that would actually probably do what we need it to do. So here's the downside: counterweight. You get way down, and you pick up something heavy. You don't have that thick dump truck to yeah. pull you back up. For I think clearing trees, I think this would might be like the most mint thing you could have. Yeah digging ponds where you're doing one of them because i even ran i ran a komatsu and it was a komatsu 300 with a fat dumper on the back of it i mean she's wide and i remember i was digging mud and when it would when the teeth would get stuck it would pull me in oh God. and then i have to get out and that even had the dump truck on it 
you know? So I think we need a you need a fat, you need a fat you need a fat dumpy. So you're back to that same thing where you'd rather go really big, big yeah. you already have Correct. Really small. Cuz it's like I think for clearing land this might be your deal. It's a 145 decent they're going to feel like boy, I, I feel yeah, like I parked. Low. Tell them tell them to hang on me. We'll buy something. Maybe you can just take it straight to the house. 480. 480. <laughs> Daddy. Ooh. That's a big that's a big dog there, son. We got that handled. Well, you got you got to figure it out? Yeah. How's it going? What's your name? Mike Kramer. Mike, nice to meet you. You're gonna help us select something today, maybe? Well, I Potentially. <laughs> this is what he's like usually good at. He's usually the best at. So I was, I was talking as if I know what I'm talking about. This is called a, a no no swing or no tail. Yep. And I, was I correct? I said that without having that counterweight, if you're like digging deep holes and picking up heavy stuff, well, it can be a little can, can, can be tip. See, I don't need that. Yeah, I not. I already tip things that aren't supposed to be tipped. So, how, do you know what the digging depth is on one of these guys? Like roughly? Without looking, I do not know. To be honest with you. Okay. I, I gotta see the boom and stick and figure. I feel out. like because I don't. My mini can go like I think ten or yeah. something like that right now. We That's want something nice. that can go at least like twenty. That's kind of what we were thinking. I mean, that thing doesn't even have a boom, That's but I feel. What you need. Is that it? Yeah. <laughs> really? This is the one right here. That's what I was. Banjo, we found it. This is the one. It's like Optimus Prime. Yeah. 750. How much does that weigh? Have any idea? Put like, together. Yeah, I was gonna say we don't even have the boom, but 160 thousand pounds ish. I would get that thing stuck so quick. I get my skid loader stuck, and that thing weighs like 9,000 pounds. A 300. Oh, so that's what I ran. I ran a 300. I took out the beaver. Well, I did not. Jake took out the beaver dam. I crushed the cop car, and I feel like that was a decent a huge one. Bucket. Yeah. And this one's for sale? It is. Oh, is it is it new or used? It's new. Banjo. I I honestly just didn't think they'd have a 300 that's new. I figured we just have to kind of take what we can get. That's not a small bucket. C crawl in there, show the folks. Really? Yeah, get, really get in there, really. Banjo. Get in there, let's take you for a ride. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'll yeah, it's, in there. It's, it's not small. So 300, 350. So is is a 200 size, so is it going classes like 100, 200, 300? They used to until they changed up the numbers oh so yeah, it's just it's, a curveball it's now. goofy now so yeah. is a 200 significantly smaller frame body than this guy yes it is okay yep. so that's the thing we gotta think about is like do we want to be in the 100 class 200 class or 300 class 400 is probably too much yeah. I feel like 300, 300 might and this would be the smallest 300 class te it's a, technically it's right 300 yes. okay the next size up would be this one It'd be 350 yep that yeah that that looks pretty large it smells like a new car does it iPad in there oh it does it's got two R Really? Does it, have, does it have cameras on the outside? It does. No, it doesn't. No 360 way. 360 degrees. What? No, because the one I ran did not have that. Yeah, and I hit nice. lots of stuff, so that yeah. wasn't good. No. Wow, brain spanking new 360 degrees. I like the cameras. That's that's yeah. a huge selling point for me. Changing the oil or what? She's thick. That's yeah. what she's, got a, she's got a dump truck. She's Yeah, she definitely has a dump truck. So that would keep you well balanced, so to speak. Do we know how much this guy weighs roughly? Oh. Did, did he break that? Yeah, he broke it. I did not. I gotta buy it now, damn it! You think it's like six, 60 to sixty to eighty, right? Is that like the? Yeah. I tried to research banjo. Yeah, I'm sixty not. eighty what? Hundred thousand pounds. What? You want a thumb on? It. I yeah. You probably don't have anything with factory thumb on it, do you? Wow. This thing's this is it, and they're going quick with the market right now. That's the problem. I started looking up stuff. It's like we're we're limited on the brand. We're limited on what machine, whether it's new or used. Like I talked to some guys about bulldozers and. They're not getting them until like October. That's how I got stuff to build tomorrow, you know? We're a year so, out on some stuff. A year out? Yeah, take it while you get it. That handle, this that step. Oh. Well, I definitely never use that in the other one. You need, I, you need I would, I'd be doing one of these guys. <laughs> oh man, this is way too fancy. Look at this. <laughs> Literally like an iPad in here. These Are these just rests? The two on the outside? That's that one, is that a, a like pedal. a D-cell? That's or? your straight travel pedal. So if you want to go forward and backwards straight, what? Oh, that's, that's game changing. That's only you don't what? have to use the middle articulating Correct. ones. Correct. Wow. What? This okay. This is definitely game changing. This is gonna make my life way easier. They watched that video and said we gotta make these better because yeah. they got dummies out here operating. Yeah, I don't know. How to, so I just go straight then. Yep. Wow. That's all I would do in this thing. How many hours? Thirty-four hours on it. Suckers, brand spanking now. Oh, we got speakers too. Fans will be bumping the tunes in here. Bluetooth radio. What? Ooh. What? It's heat. It's heat and cool. I imagine, right? We got. Oh, yeah. Okay. You got a heated seat too. He heated oh seat? God. Shut up! You're lying. You no, that. he's lying. There's no way, dude. That's all I'm gonna do in the winter. It's gonna snow. And I'm like, all right, I'll see you guys later. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just gonna, be, I'm gonna plow my driveway with an excavator. Okay, this might be the one, dude. I, I, you, I think you got me. Seat, you sold him. You got me. And this thing, you can change buckets on this. Is that what? Correct. That thing does maybe. A quick coupler. So we can get different kinds of buckets. Cause yeah, does it come with the bucket, or is there different buckets that this would come with? We, uh, or is this the one? You order a thumb. We'll match the thumb with the bucket. Well, oh yeah, because they have to. 
Yep, got it. Because that one's got some so interesting what size teeth. Bucket would you put? Fifty-four. And is this? This is sixty. Okay, so it'd be a hair smaller. Because that's just because you're putting a thumb on it. Got it. Because it has to, it has to match. But yeah, look at these. These are kind of interesting. You said these are for frost, yes. so you kind of like score it or whatever. I say we get delivered at the house and just start digging ponds. See how see how long how, far, how many ponds we can get before Macy realizes it. You like that <laughs> idea? Like just right in the backyard. One for just dig. One for yeah, Lucy, so one for we got to be a training pond for. We only have two ponds. We need a third one. one for, like, this might be the deal. <laughs> this might be the deal. We're gonna have to, we'll have to put some thought in it, but I think the sizing makes sense. So you said you're gonna do tree work and thumb. Two hundred is probably too small. Not too small, but, but you'll like this better. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I want to go all around. Yep. Yeah. I don't like want to show up to a project and be like, man, this thing's too small. Yeah. No. So this, this thing, I feel like this thing could handle yeah, pretty much. It's a lot bigger than the mini. There's that difference. I, yeah. I think this could pick up and throw the mini. Oh yeah. Just, hey. just yeet the yeah. mini. I think we could do that. Truck. You want to get rid of your truck or? No, yours. Though. Oh, we have the we have the Ford Ranger. Oh, we could destroy the Ford so Ranger. Or we can throw it. Yes. Have a competition. All right, we'll, we'll have to get this and destroy the Ford Ranger. You guys stay tuned. Shoo! The excavator has arrived, ladies. Look at this. <laughs> we ended up buying it, folks. We got her done, did. It's a big old unit. That's a big old unit. I just got to get out of your way, I guess. Jump in and go. Okay. All right. Thank you, guys. Yep, thank you. So they don't check if you know how to run these things? No. So they just drop them off. No, you give them the money, they don't care. Dude, this thing is huge, bro. I can't even see the top of the boom. Oh my god. Dude, this has got to be bigger than the other one I ran. This is massive. So where where do I go? I didn't figure out where the throttle is. The throttle? Yeah. Well, that's go that's go mode. It's a little wet for this today. Yeah, that's better. I was crawling. I felt bad, but he's probably heel not to drive. I don't. That's the funny thing. Dude, this has got to be bigger than the one I've ran before. This is huge. Like, I this, can't even reach Like, you it. can't look. You can't even see the top of the boom. Like, I'm sitting back. Oh, my God. You can't even. <laughs> what do you think? Pop Beefcake don't even know this is here. We should see what he has to say. Let's I'm going to tear up my yard. I, I can't even drive. That is insane. Isn't that crazy? A oh, 3D. Shows you where your boom is. Oh, your God, boom. yeah. Oh and then look, we got our iPad 360 right there. I have literally genuinely have no idea how to use this. I'll be 100% honest. Like, I am so underprepared for this moment. I need a crash course on this. Like, I, I know how to run it, but I'm sure I don't know the little things. Like, the, oh, the, you know, don't do it like that, do it like that. You know, the Did little. Just throwing bunny mode already? Yeah, I, I was trying to go fast. <laughs> but I didn't. I knew that was the throttle, but I just didn't. I, I thought that was the. Uh, so you see, have, you have different patterns mm. with the joysticks. Yeah. But I think you change that in the back. Like, there's like different switches. Kind of like having H and I pattern yeah, on yeah. Like, the skid loader. So I see. H and I, and I'm like, oh God, I'm gonna hit the wrong button. But I think that's what it is. This just must be idle, high, fast, go mode. I don't know, <laughs> I don't know what those mean. I mean, I'm just guessing. I gotta like YouTube this sucker. Like how to, you probably should have done that before. Oh, you can change the camera angles. Bro, that's a top view. Look at that. That's a top view. There's all the, whatever Dude, it is. Oh, look at Buddy, see Buddy's back there. That's your backup and your side. Yeah, and that's straight over the top. Dude, this is wild. Uh, this is cool. I like this little video game thing going on here. The little iPad. I'm just gonna start. Laser beam? Where does it have a laser beam? Huh? So you can shoot a laser from this to Wait. like a... Touch point? Oh god, I'm about to absolutely screw this whole thing up. S quick measure? Oh, I see. Okay, whoops. Oh, I transfer. What did I, who did I send that to? Go to, to? Smart View. What's Smart View? Nah, that's yeah, pretty smart. That's, that's that thing's smart. Yeah, that's like, probably what you have to pay. Yeah, for. I'm that's, guessing that. I'm guessing we don't system. have that. Quick, what's it measuring? Oh, okay. Yeah. That, no, I think it's we we, we lost. The, we don't have the software. I don't think. Yeah, we might take it down to the animals. Rip this old biscuit out. Should we rip her out? Yeah. So we, don't, so we don't need that sucker. I know we don't have a thumb. That's what sucks. Seven weeks, bro. Seven weeks. We gotta wait for the thumb and my new. That's not my bucket. Shout out to Wise. They at least lended me a bucket so I could get to do beefcake construction things sooner rather than later. But that's that's a loaner bucket, so it's not my bucket. Is that 54 inches wide? Okay, I was gonna say I was like that seems really narrow. I want a wider bucket than that. Is it 45? 42? So I so I've got a what I said 55, 54. 54. So no, okay, I was gonna say that just seems. No, yours is 56. 50, yours is 56 coming. 56 or 54. 54, I think. Yeah, it might 50, 54. But either way, bigger, about a foot bigger than that, which is good. I mean, that's that'll get done what what I need to get done for now. I mean, basically seven weeks. I was like, bro, we got ponds to be digging. The ranch, we need a road at the ranch uh, for the cabin, so we gonna need that. We need a lot of stuff, basically, and that's what this bad boy is for. Like, that's what's crazy. Is it's really cold today. If you guys can't tell, it's freezing. I could be in here with the freaking heat. Oh, the tune's going because it's got Bluetooth. I'll be I'll be bumping to Rick Ross, digging holes and shit, you know. Like, I'm I'm excited. I want to give you guys the full the full tour of this bad boy and then it's super wet 
So we're not gonna do anything today. Like, I don't know what we're gonna do, but we'll just, we'll wait for it to dry out before we do something. We're gonna do something today, or, or I shouldn't say today, but in this video, we'll do something. We gotta crush something, we gotta pick up something, we gotta yeet something, something's gotta happen. Today's probably it's not that day because it's too wet, it's too cold, it's too windy. And also like Bands Pool Gen aren't here. We didn't even know it's gonna get delivered today. So uh, I guess this is good. And uh, I didn't, uh, they just assume I knew how to ride the, drive this thing, which yeah. I, I mean, I'll get it. I don't know what, oh, oh, Brad's gonna be excited. It's got a freaking horn. So we've got all sorts, I think that's, I don't know what that is, maybe your thumb deal, I don't, I'm literally gonna go inside and Google Volvo 300 tutorial, cause I, I don't know what to do with this sucker, and then once I understand it, I'll pick up the video and, and maybe give you guys the full, the full tour, so stay tuned. Alright folks, it's been a couple days. It's been somewhat dried out. It's still just a hair moist, not terrible. Uh, but big Sheila, look at that dump truck. Sheesh! Yep, she has not gotten any smaller, folks. Well, been a couple days, like I said, we wanted to dry out because I was making that kind of a mess. And we gotta re-gravel this anyways, but what's Banjo doing? You trying to whip me or what? No, I just found it. Just what were you gonna do with the rope? Rope swing? How about how about this? Oh. We tie to the excavator and you hang on. I don't know about We that. swing you around, yeah. huh? You like that idea? I'm down. Banjo, what do you think of the, uh, what do you think I've of this? I've already seen this one. No, you haven't. Not on your property. Huh? Yeah, Banjo was with us when we looked at it. At the oh. Wise. Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah, true. Yeah. Uh, what do you think about this? <laughs> it's wise. It's thick. She, dude, the that, she got the old Dom truck. She is you looked thick. at the ones without the ass. No, the I wanted ass. I wanted Sheila with the ass. You know, that was important. What's well, inside look like? The inside is, is uh, it's nice. It's got How do you get in this heat thing? and AC. Um, well, there's your step. That's I got to unlock this sucker. Look. look at this. Oh, I already got it muddy. Are you kidding me? What oh the hell? All right, so we'll give you guys the full, here, I'll give you this. I gotta get the old full tour here. We showed a little bit, but. So up here, this is your go-go lever right there, okay? Uh, we've got the other controls. I, I did some Googling, okay? I, uh, oh, hell yeah. We got a cup. What's in Liquid's it? Anything in it? important? Do not remove or discard until installation. What are we installing? Yeah. Did you already install it? Yeah. Oh, is there a uh, seat behind you? So it's not a seat. Wait, what? You want to ride back oh, there? I could ride back there. Andrew could definitely ride back yeah, there. Yeah. Oh, did, you, did you get that thing put together? No, what is that? Your appendix? No, I must have, I must have missed that note. Oh. Yeah. Well, let's go ahead and get this bad boy started. Where's the horn? Hang on, Banjo. You can do whatever you want. You own it. Imagine it just doesn't start. Oh, this thing's quiet. Yeah, it's not that loud. I don't know why loud. I expect it to no. be loud. So, idle. F is for lifting heavy things. G, mm, I don't remember G. And then H is like everything super high. And then you can turn on like extra H mode. Well, I don't know if that one has oh, look it. Look at that computer. Look at this guy. I got an iPad. You see this? Oh, it gives you like a 3D. Yeah. So what? why is turbo hot shut down? What happened there? Did it shut down when it was, the turbo was hot? What about over here? There, oh, there's oh, the yeah. horn. Look at Jake. Where's, where's he going? Oh, where's Junior at? Yeah, how's it going? Why well, didn't you raise that mirror so I can actually see out there? Let's oh, do not. Let's see do not. Going. Give me a thumbs up if you can hear me. If the quality looks good. I know it's like angled jet a little. Hopefully it doesn't irritate anyone too bad. I'm going to listen to Banjo Podcast. Shoo. All right, we're getting shoes, so you guys must hear me. Dude, I'll, I'd, be in, I'd be in here all day long just listening to the, to the podcast Banjo? and stuff. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I can barely reach the pedal first. This is good. Oh, gotcha. Get back there. Oh, really? Oh, God, oh, yeah. we might be all right. You got cup holders back here for me and everything. Really? How you? comfortable is that? I'm very uncomfortable. Oh, there's the 360. Look at that. Oh! oh. Look at all the different views. Try to knock this tree over. I think this tree is kind of the best. Yeah, do it. I, I think Ty's going to have to get off out. I'm going to clip your legs. Yeah, good point. Banjo, do you want to? So, Wait, no, you can film from out there. Go ahead. Can I go on that platform? Does that move with you? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. You'll be fine. Oh, that'd be a cool view. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Yeah, okay. now i guess oh yeah that's a that was a bigger tree than i thought like oh, the yeah. root i mean look at this that's a pretty big tree <laughs> i like it gone we should have done that earlier 
Now we actually have room here. I just, we gotta fix that, but. The minor details. Green skid loader down here. Yeah. Oh God, what happened here? There's a nice stick. Real railroad tie, couple. Oh yeah. yeah. Save that thing. The railroad tie, I know. There. There's a T post in there too. Yeah, I gotta clear all. I gotta clear all this out. Yeah, I'm still obviously. It's it runs the same as a mini, but your actions have very large consequences if you're not paying attention. Versus the mini, it's like, oh, whoops, just hit the, you know, whatever. This is like, whoops, just knocked my house down. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, you guys, so I'm, I'm I'm a little bit more careful. And you guys, how was it up there? Was if you feel safe? Yeah, yeah it's it was not, pretty it's a little smooth. jerky, but it's not Because I wasn't like, I was also thinking of you guys in mind, like. I hit one button, ejecto seat though, you go, you know, eating or something. It was actually so. pretty smooth when you were driving. Wasn't too bad. That was pretty impressive. And I'm not, the reason why I was rocking is my tracks aren't squared. Yeah. But I didn't want to mess with it because I'm not trying to tear this gravel out. Because if I square up, I could have just bulldozed it. But I came in at an angle, and the more I drive, the more I'm going to rip this up. And we're going to come grade all this anyways. I mean, I mean, Rick, talk about ripping it up. Yeah, we're going to have to fix fix that but to be honest it's e it'd be easier with the skid loader to fix all this another thing so we don't have a thumb which is unfortunate seven weeks we'll have some but another thing that i thought of potential once we have a thumb especially we could try it now just since we're out here we could try to grab a hay bale because so i could probably we need to take it up and around there because we're actually going to take this sucker to the ranch at some point i don't know if we're going to try to do any projects here we talked about maybe digging a pond where the mud pit is we might do that here anyone else yeah no. Yeah, it sounds like there's an animal yeah. there. Yeah, anyone, no one else has been hearing that? It sounds like there's like a raccoon over there. Uh, we, were, we were talking about maybe digging a pond up here. We're not sure, but I need to get it up to my house in order to load it back on the semi because we need to take it to the ranch. So we need to take it up there anyway. But I was thinking, well, while I'm already driving, I could literally sit in the middle of the road, grab a hay bale, and turn and yeet it in the animal pen, which would make things a lot easier than uh, you know a, a skid loader, I guess. So Especially a, with a three hundred thousand dollar hay bale feeder. Sure. <laughs> it's essential. Essential. What we got. So let's see if we can give. Should we give it, it to Ralph, or should we? I don't know if I can get to Ralph actually. Big animals, the big animals. Big animal pen because okay. it's pretty muddy. Oh, so true. The, the, the hay, the hay might help that. So, all right, let's go get these guys some hay. How am I losing right now? That's that's amazing. The hay bale. I mean, I was doing pretty good about like keeping it up and rolling it. I might. I don't know if, if I have enough room. If I go forward to, to curl it, I'll try. I'll go forward. I need a, imagine, if I can't do this, how am I supposed to clear trees out though? I got I need a thumb. I mean you got hay. Yeah. Oh well, yeah. hey. That's what I'm saying. I don't I think I I'm basically this thing's useless without thumb for me. This thing's for digging. If we, if we all we gotta do is dig holes out here. It's the only thing we can do. We can't pick anything up. Can't. Well, I can move trees. I cleared trees. Yeah. I pushed them, but grabbing them, no. Watch out, man! Oh God, I'm way in the tree. <laughs> this thing is too big for the house. Yeah, I am basically useless without that thumb. I can dig a hole. That's about it. But. Man, could you imagine how easy that would be, though? <laughs> just rip it. If you could throw it in there and then pinch the wrapping and yeah, just rip the wrapping and I'm just saying. whoosh. Yeah. Maybe we gotta try it again once we got the thumb. Look at they're excited. Look I at love them. it. <laughs> they're excited. 
Look at these guys. Dale, get in the bucket. Llama. Hey, delivery, Llama. Look at her. Why is she cheesing? Look at her Look at her face. Come here, Llama. Let me see, let me see them pearly whites you got. Come here, Llama. Ah, we need to take you to the dentist. Man, look at them chops. No, I don't want it. We should, oh, we should put Pedro up. Put Pedro in the bucket. Well, folks, we got an excavator. As you can tell, it's not for here. We got it for the range. We didn't get it for the house. I, I know how to use it. You're probably watching. Oh, my God, Flair. Flair just spends all his money. He has no idea what he's actually doing. That's a true statement. But I know how to operate it. I'm not great at it. I'm getting used to it. I've never operated it in tight, confined areas like this. Though. I'm always just up in the open cornfields and stuff like that. So, you know, that's what the mini's for. You want to do a little work, mini's good for that. This is, when we talked about, we wanted something big, not kind of in the middle. A 200 would probably be like the ultimate farm slash whatever. But since I already had the mini, I figured I might as well go big so I can actually dig some bigger, bigger holes, bigger ponds, stuff like that. But um, yeah, that's a steamy. You see that? God dang, son. You see the steam rolling off of it? She looked me in the eye when it dropped too. She was all about it. Well, we got, we got the animals a little bit of hay. I'm gonna have to go grab the skid loader and fix that probably at some point here. Um, but thumb, five, six, seven weeks, hopefully you'll see me. We're gonna redeem ourselves. One of these days, if I ever get it back here or wherever, if the excavators ever where the animals are, I'll redeem myself and pick up a bale and give it to them. But for now, I gotta stick to knocking trees over and digging holes. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. We'll catch you on the next one. And peace.